coming to you live in the gym at Sullivan Park, New Mexico. This is the 343 commitment and still counting. 110th floor Memorial Stair Climb for our brother Kevin O'Rourke from Rescue 2 Brooklands Bulldogs. This climb is dedicated to his wife, Marianne and daughters, Corinne and Jamie. Your husband and father will never be forgotten. This is a 343 commitment and still counting. For our brother who is 44 years old and uh, prior to joining the FDNY, he was a captain with the Cedarhurst, I believe it was, uh, Lindenhurst. I'm a little bit lost on the name of the volunteer department, but he was a volunteer as a captain prior to joining the FDNY. So this is his climb. Gonna take him up to the 110th floor. First vertical to seven. For our brother, Kevin O'Rourke, rescue two. It said uh, during the research that our brother Kevin had been on about 20 years on the department. He was 44 years old when he responded on 9-11. As part of Rescue 2, there with John Napolitano and crew, our brother is now the fifth brother of Rescue 2 to be carried to the top. And right now, this is his climb. Taking him all the way up with honor and respect. One thing I thought that was really cool is uh, when Kevin was at the firehouse, any of the neighborhood kids with broken chains, wheel spokes, or anything like that, wrong with their bike, would go find Kevin, and uh, he would fix their bikes for them. It was so cool that he had done it so much that the brothers from the Bulldogs Rescue 2 I actually put up a little sign that said Kevin's Bike Shop. So he would actually uh, take care of the community around him. I couldn't find a whole lot of information as far as his awards, but it said that uh, he had a chest full of medals. One of the things that I did find out was that our brother was a husband to Marianne and a father to his daughters, Corinne and uh, Jamie. This 110 is to finish their footsteps, to carry our brothers with honor and respect all the way, symbolically, to the top of the towers. And right now, this one is for our Irish brother, Kevin O'Rourke, Rescue to his Bulldogs. Our brother was one of 
Uh, FDNY Special Operations Command with Rescue 2 there in Brooklyn. I've had the honor of actually going to Rescue 2 at the Bulldogs. I had the honor to uh, pay my respects and spend time there at the house there in Brooklyn. Thanks to Jennifer and Jack McNamara. About two years ago, when we took the trip to uh, St. John's to go have lunch, we then went to Rescue 2 and spent time with the Bulldogs, during which time I was able to talk to uh, Brendan Iopi and tell him about the commitment and that I was going to climb for his brother, Jonathan Iopi from uh, Squad 288. I was there with Hazmat Company 1. So this climb is with honor and respect given. Carrying our brother, the owner of Kevin's Bike Shop, to the very top. It said that uh, he did not make the fire department a career, but instead it was his calling. He was meant to be a fireman. He was gonna be a firefighter ever since growing up, it said that he always wanted to be a firefighter. For my brother, who it says that the family would always get together for a yearly golf outing or ski trip. There was a uh, annual firefighter ski games at Hunter Mountain to which Kevin, and I believe it said there was a five man team, would ski down the mountain wearing their coats and helmets and they had to help pose while they were skiing. One of the years that he did that, they came in fifth place and uh, he felt really good about that. So right now, I can't think of a more fitting thing to do for a new year then carry our brother Kevin O'Rourke from the Bulldogs of Rescue 2 to the 110th floor. Thank you everyone for the well wishes and the birthday greetings. It's amazing to see how many family members across the fire service, across the states, and across the world. Remember things. So again, thank you. It's hard to believe, but I'm 43 today. So this is my birthday climb for our brother Kevin O'Rourke, Bulldogs, Rescue 2. And right now, this is for his wife, Marianne, and daughters, Corinne and Jim, uh, Jamie. One thing I did see while doing the research was that uh, his wife, Marianne, and daughter, Jamie, were on a YouTube video from Ireland. They had a 360 uh, 9-11 exhibition at a museum there. And in the exhibition was our brother Kevin O'Rourke's helmet, photograph, 
and from what I understood, a piece of steel from there on 9-11. All the way in Ireland, they paid respects by hosting the exhibition for a father and a husband. We will never forget. And looks like I'm going to be leaving. I'll be back. Better Kevin O'Rourke, Rescue 2, a captain with the Lawrence Cedarhurst Volunteer Fire Department prior to joining the FDNY. This climb is dedicated to his wife Marianne and daughters Corinne and Jamie. I've got 69 floors left of uh, this climb to carry our brother all the way to the top. Live from Southern Park in the gym. It's a 343 commitment and still counting. Thank you, James. I appreciate it, brother. Let's get him to the top. So as I was talking about before we got that call, um, I saw a YouTube video with his wife Marianne and daughter Jamie in Ireland. Ireland had a museum exhibition for 9-11. It was a 360 exhibition. And uh, this exhibition held firefighter Kevin O'Rourke's helmet, his photograph, and what I understood, what I heard, was a piece of steel from 9-11. This is the second attempt of this climb. Currently going up to the 69th floor with 41 completed already. For our brother, firefighter Kevin O'Rourke, out of the Bulldog, Special Operations Command of the FDNY. For our brother, who held Kevin's bike shop outside of Rescue 2 with the community children being able to go get their bikes fixed to his service on Squad 1 and the Bulldogs. The most technically special expertise in FDNY Special Operations Command. Those on the heavy rescues, one through five, the squads, and Hazmat Company One. Our brother Kevin O'Rourke, whose climb is going up right now, was on Rescue Two, the Bulldogs. I've been to Rescue Two, got time to spend out there, and paying honor respect to the brothers till just getting to sit down and talk. Thank you to Jennifer McNamara for that opportunity a few years back. I had an opportunity to talk to Andrew Ielpi, Jonathan Ielpi's brother, and I was able to explain to him the commitment and the climbs that were ongoing. Right now, this 110 completion with the two climbs is to carry our brother, who, along with 343 others, as part of the initial response, 343 brothers, from the FDNY. Responded to the worst terrorist attack 
on US soil. Okay, 9-11. Part of the greatest rescue effort in US history. Where efforts of 25,000 were saved because of the bravery and heroism that was shown. Selfless acts that our brothers knew and yet still went because it was their calling. It was their career to save others. This is why we climb. A hundred tip floors taking our brothers symbolically to the top of the towers. This is climb five of seven for rescue two of the Bulldogs. One of five heavy rescues. Rescue one outstanding to the Bulldogs. Three big blue, four Popeye, and five blue thunder. We will never forget the sacrifices made on and those that came after with the ants still counting. Those that worked the pile for days, weeks, and months until fruition, resolve for the FDY and their families and our country. This is why we climb. As I said before, I could not tell, based on the research, how many combinations are a wage for bravery that uh, our brother Kevin O'Rourke had received. But they did say he had a chest full of medals. They also said that he was a very quiet guy around the station. But when you put him in a fire, he went to town. He would go deep and sometimes get caught up in trying to rescue. And said so that one time he walked across the floor and the floor opened up beneath him. So he went down and braced himself while waiting for his brothers to pull him out the hole and back on solid ground. During his time off, he spent it with his wife, Marianne, and daughters, Corinne and Jamie. It said they would go golfing or skiing at a yearly event. It also said that he was part of a firefighter uh, ski challenge on Hunter Mountain where they would have to have five person teams and he would uh, basically, they would wear their helmets and their coats and they would have to hump hose while skiing down. And it's said one of those years with all the competitors that actually made fifth place and for that he was very proud. Our brother, was 44 years old on 9-11. We will never forget the sacrifices that were made so that others could live. And right now we're climbing up for rescue two. As I said before, this is the 343 commitment. That's still counting. 110 floors for our brother firefighter, Kevin O'Rourke, Rescue Two's Bulldogs. Technical specialist in high angle, confined space, scuba. 
Oh, the discipline. A technical rescue. And right now, this is his. Second run of 69 floors with the original 41 before we got the call. Equals the 110. We're getting there to finish this climb. This is the reason we climb. So always remember to never forget. It's not for us, but for them. For the families, the FDNY, and for our country. This is the 251st climb. Getting down to the low 90s before we break into the 80s and counting until we finish the original 343. This is why we climb. To finish our footsteps. My brother, who had either 20 or 20 and over, Years on the FDNY. Carrying him up with honor and respect. All the way to the top. For our brother, who was a volunteer captain, prior to joining. The FDNY. My husband and Mary Ann, a father to his daughters Corinne and Jamie. We will never forget. The sacrifices that were made so that others could live. We're just uh, rounding out to the 47th floor of 69 on the second run up the stairs to finish 110. Last two verticals for this climb. Couldn't think of a better way to get today out than another brother to be carried vertical. And uh, this is why we climb. Taking them all the way up. We reach the top. Our Irish brother, who is known for taking care of the kids in this community. While they would actually get their bike fixed, it said he rolled out a rug and would teach fire safety, like stop, drop, and roll, in case their clothes caught fire. Selfless service. My brother was a son, a husband, a father, a brother, and our brother. 
pushing him all the way up. For our brother. Firefighter. Kevin O'Rourke. Rescue two of the Bulldogs. Out of Brooklyn. It said, during his tenure, he also worked on Squad One. Also part of Special Operations Command. And uh, Squad One has a dear place to my heart also, as all do, with uh, Gary Box's family. Solar family. We will never forget all the sacrifices that were made on and after 9 11, 2001. Coming up on almost the last 10 floors. Taking them all the way to the very top. Floor 41 to 110. Pushing them out. Each step closer to the next floor. This is why we climb. For our brothers, who made the ultimate sacrifice. On and after, 9-11, 2001. There are now 92 brothers left to reach. 100th floor. This is why we climb right here. Mary Ann, daughters Corinne and Jamie, your husband and father will never be forgotten. His legacy will be carried forward across the world as you saw in Ireland. This is why we climb. For the families, for our brothers, for our country. This is coming up on the 110th floor shortly with both combined climbs. Last floor, 41 completed, 69 added. Pushing them up. Firefighter Kevin O'Rourke, 44 years old, our Irish brother. And with that, the second half completed. Rest easy, brother. We got it from here. Fifth brother, rescue two up top. <laughs>